Right now at 6 o'clock, investigators still on scene after a boat went up in flames near the Roosevelt Bridge in Stewart. The black smoke could be seen for miles. Now, two people were rushed to the hospital. Witnesses telling News Channel 5 a family of four lived on the boat. We have team coverage. We start with News Channel 5's Megan McRoberts. She is live at Shepherd's Park in Stewart. Megan. Well, investigators still don't know what caused that 45 foot single mass sailboat to catch fire right here near Shepherd's Park. But right now, Stewart police and fire crews remain out here working to preserve what's left of the boat. They're still trying to determine if they can safely tow it away without it falling apart and damaging the little evidence that they have left. Now, I can tell you this was a powerful fire. Investigators say it likely spread very quickly. It also caused a secondary propane tank explosion. Investigators say at least two adults were on board and taken to Martin Memorial for treatment for smoke inhalation. We've also just learned that at least one of those adults has been moved to a hospital in Miami for further treatment. Fire officials say they were both off of the boat when they arrived to the scene. Stewart police say that the two adults likely lived on the boat. They're also working to determine if there was possibly a third person, possibly a child, that was also aboard. We're always going to look and make sure that, that you know, there, there wasn't anybody else. Uh, we don't have true confirmation that there was anybody else on there, but that is something that we are looking for. Now, sir, police also telling me that an environmental company also came by today to make sure that any soot and fluids left in that boat aren't draining into the waterway here. Police again saying that this will likely be a slow investigation tonight to make sure that they can preserve this evidence. So they are expecting to be out here for several more hours. We're going to bring you any new developments on this story tonight here on News Channel 5 at 11 o'clock. Reporting live in Stewart, Megan McRoberts, WPTV News Channel 5. Well, boaters and those who live near the water dialed 911 after seeing the flames and black smoke. News Channel 5's Jamel Anae spoke to one man who called for help. She continues our team coverage from Stewart. I'm standing by the boat ramp near Ocean Boulevard in US 1, where environmentalists are inspecting the boat before it's hauled off by investigators because authorities say this boat is now a crime scene. It's completely burned, a 42 foot sailboat known to people who live near here. Boaters and people who live on the water dialed 911 after the boat erupted into flames around 10 a.m. One man could see the boat burning from his backyard. He says he knows the people who were on. On that boat. He says he ran out when he heard there was a fire and that's when the propane tank exploded. He feared that others could have been hurt from the explosion. Thrown debris a good distance probably. A full-size propane tank exploding. Yeah, that I mean, people heard it down at the park. It was fully involved front to back. The mast had already melted off. FWC and the Stewart Police Department, they are looking into this boat fire, which remains under investigation. That's the latest here in Stewart. Jamel Anae, WPTV News Channel 5.